Did you know the Underground Railroad was not an actual railroad, nor a real-life train system that traversed across the South? It was, in fact, something even more remarkable. It was a network of people, African-American as well as white, offering shelter and aid to escaped enslaved people from the South. It developed as a convergence of several different clandestine efforts. In the Deep South, the Fugitive Slave Act of 1793 made capturing escaped enslaved people a lucrative business, and there were fewer hiding places for them. Fugitive enslaved people were typically on their own until they got to certain points farther north. On another note, Negro spirituals were songs of hope for the future. They were also protest songs. Many songs inspired African Americans to run away and escape enslavement. The Underground Railroad used spirituals and railroad language as secret codes to assist enslaved African Americans to freedom. People known as conductors guided the fugitive enslaved people. Hiding places included private homes, churches, and schoolhouses were called stations, safe houses, and depots. The people operating them were called station masters.